everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Karen. How are you doing? Finally, I'm filming this video. I've been so busy with Black Friday and Cyber Monday promotions. Today, everything is pink. Let's talk about Rhodochrosite, Rhodonite, and Strawberry Quartz. These three healing stones are associated with your heart chakra, help you improve any relationships, and bring you a good love life. It is worth mentioning that Rhoda Crosai, she has the beauty of pink and she's also one of the best healing stones for women. Very helpful for the energy of your glandular, especially for the thymus and breasts. When I prepared this video, I found I have so much to talk about Rhoda Crosai, and my phone has no more memory for a long video. So um, I will break it into two parts. Today, let's do Rhodochrosite. Rhodochrosite, most products selling in the market are from Argentina and Peru. It's usually in pink with white, yellow or black lines. You can see these layers of banding, light pink and white linear or black pattern. This is the common formation of rhodochrosite, also the common grading. So the first spot is the pattern of rhodochrosite. Now let's see this so-called rhodochrosite look-alike strands. I bought this online from a Zhejiang seller because I can't find any imitation products in our market yet. Let's compare the color and the pattern. Obviously, they are not the same at all. But in case you really see something look like this called rhodochrosite, just stay away. Now I will show you the testing results. This strand is color dyed treatment quartzite B strands. And the other one. Also, color dye treatment quartzite B strands. So, again, imitation products are made with quartzite and color dyed. Now let's see the real one. Ling Mang Kong Saolin, Ling Mang Kong Rhodochrosite, Hong Man Set. The second spot is the hardness of rhodochrosite. It's very low between 3 to 5 on the moss hardness and the hardness of imitation products are much higher. Even if it's a brand new rhodochrosite bracelet, it has the abrasion on the edge of the beehole. You see that? And look at my rhodochrosite bracelet. Yeah, I've been wearing it for over a year. You see? It also happens in high-grade rhodochrosite. But 
with imitation products, they are all with perfect condition. The third spot is the weight. You are looking at rhodochrosite raw stones. They usually grow with other minerals like pyrite. It's really beautiful, which makes natural rhodochrosite a lot heavier than the fake or imitation products. Also much heavier than clear quartz, amethyst, or citrine. I'll show you this cube rhodochrosite. It's cut from a very large raw stone. I got this from the factory. You see the white lines and yellow lines. We are going to make it as a B, a large one. Yeah, so we have to cut it like a cube shape and then we round it. And then this two as well. These are for cabotrons. So you take a guess which one is a higher quality. Yes, the right one because it's more red and no white lines no yellow lines more red nice clarity and no white lines or black lines or black spot is top quality to high quality since high quality rhodochrosite is rare and really expensive you can purchase according to your budget because normal gray rhodochrosite has the same healing energy. Now I will leave one question for you. Which bracelet is a better quality? Okay, there are two stones will be easily mislabeled as rhodochrosite. The first one is pork stone and the other one is rhodonite, which we are going to talk about in the next video. So just stay with my channel. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.